from Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort. Corey and I are here to dine at Sebastian's Bistro. It just opened up for walk-ins, so we just got on the list. It's a 50 minute wait for two, so we're just gonna hang out and wait for our table to be called. We checked out our house, um, the walk-in list, and it said there wasn't any available, so we were really worried. But when we pulled up to Caribbean Beach, we got in for a 50 minute wait. Here we are. I think you have to go through the lobby to get to Sebastian's Bistro. Mm, smells really good and tropical in here. I like this new lobby. It's really pretty. Corey and I got drinks from over here, Banana Cabana, and he got a guava colada drink. And I got a beer and it's starting to rain, so we are under this thing right now because we don't want to get wet. A storm is coming, but this is a pretty cool place to be. The skyliner in the background is pretty cool. Oh, I love these ducks. They like to go under the water. It's so funny. Oh, yeah. Down over here, that way, it's starting to storm. And I just saw some lightning, and they're just making everyone get out of the pool. Oh, but it's time to get there. I was hoping we were done with storms for today. There's the Riviera. Looks very really pretty and majestic with the gray clouds in the background. They have the new wishable pins. I think I need to get a couple of these, but I don't know how to get this thing out, so I'll probably have to ask someone. But here's the new wishable pins. I need Lumiere and Cogsworth. These are so cute. It's really packed in here because everyone is in here because of the rain. I just checked Sebastian's. They are at capacity for walk-in. So if we would have came just a little bit later, we would not have been able to come. Okay, we are going to open up my pins I just got. I think there's like uh, four in here or something. So let's see. I can't even open it. Oh, here we go. I'm really nervous. Okay, there's four in here. I really want Beauty and the Beast, but... Oh, I did not get Beauty and the Beast. Okay, I got Tika, Peter Van, Woody, and Spaceship Mickey. Oh! And one. Oh, there's five in here. And then one of the country bears. I actually have to go back and get the country bear from the other one. <laughs> okay, the lifeguard has the pin I want. Country bear. Hopefully these little kids do not take my pin. You wanna take it? I got my country bear pin. I just traded for it. I'm so happy. Now I have the complete country bear set. We have seven more minutes before our 15 minute wait is up. Let's see if they actually see this on time. I'm guessing no because of the rain. I bet they got slowed down a bit, but a little bit, but that's just my guess. We are slightly over 50 minutes. Hopefully it is not too much longer, but we shall see. It's still storming over here. It's past us, so it's kind of off in the distance. Skyliners are stopped. There's Corey. We're going on about an hour now, which we recorded 50 minutes, but that's fine. I just checked. We have two people ahead of us, so hopefully it shouldn't be too much longer. There's some wicked lightning over here. I wish I could capture it, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Oh wow, it's really dark over here. While we're still waiting to be sat, 
I will show you the clouds that are coming in. It's super dark. Just the pool. If you come in the summer, just bet on it, stormy, once a day, at least. Today, I think it's like two times. June, it seems to be kind of worse than the others. July and August, it's mostly like one storm per day. June seems like it comes down all the time. Here's their menu. So, Sebastian just turned into family style, which means they bring the food out to you. It's $29 per adult, $17 per kid, and you get all of this food. And I've heard really good reviews about it, so hopefully it's pretty good. It's getting really dark over here. Corey said it's still gonna miss us, but it looks pretty dark and you can't even tell in the video, but it is really dark over here. Lots of lightning too. And we still haven't been to yet. We're about like 60, 63 minutes or 65 minutes or something. And we are coded 50 minutes. We finally got set. We were coded 50 minutes and we waited an hour and 33 minutes for you to set. So definitely a lot longer, but it smells delicious in here and it's just really pretty. There was just the loudest crack of lightning. Oh my god, the entire restaurant just screamed. That was kind of scary. Look at these faces. They have Mickey heads on them. So cute. We got our appetizers. This is the pull apart rolls. Caramelized onion jam on the right. And I guess guava butter on the left. And then this is the salad. It has pumpkin seeds, radishes. What else did it have? Oh, a key lime vinaigrette, I think. It looks pretty good. We decided to add on the coconut shrimp. Maybe this does not come with your meal, but um, it's $8 extra, I believe. And it comes with this like spicy sauce and then the shrimp. There's like six shrimp here. So far, everything gets two thumbs up. I would give two thumbs up if I could, but we both really like it. Um, we had to wait a little bit longer, but all the food is really good so far. But we're only on the appetizer. It is really coming down now. You really see it. We are happy to be inside. Hopefully, we're not done until the rain ends completely. We just got our food. This is the side. Broccolini. Um, apparently this is like a curry vegetable with um, curry sauce and then beans and rice and this is the entree. This is the grilled chicken. The pork which looks really good. Oh, what is this? Steak with pineapple on top? Yeah. Oh, it's pretty good. We ordered one thing got the pork because it is just so good. That was definitely the best thing on the plate. So who want to do the car now? You can do it. Okay. Take it, take a video. Take a picture beforehand. Oh, okay. Thanks. Dessert has arrived. Corey is going to do the honor of pouring it on the dessert. It smells like pineapples. Not quite as pretty as Ohana, but looks pretty good. We just finished off the bread pudding. I have ate as much as I can. We both agree that this bread pudding is much better than the one that they currently have at Ohana, but not as good as how Ohana bread pudding used to be. But overall, pretty good. Well, we are done. That was kind of a long dinner. It's 8, it's almost 9 p.m. We're normally eating dinner at like 7 p.m. or something. But we are done. It was very good. I would definitely go back. I would crave that pork again, the salad, and the bread. 
for Amazing Annabelle for two adults was only $63. That is like so cheap for Disney standards. So I would recommend it. I think the quality is super good. And of course, it's the same thing. It's really good. And $29 a person. There was so much food there. Kind of like a steal. That's how much food it is. But overall, it was really good. I think I'd probably give it like a five out of five. It was delicious. The chicken, ah, the chicken and the, uh, um, the steak wasn't that good, but everything else was really good, especially the pork.